Hi, I'm Peter. And I'm Kimberly. We're Home Caravan Services. Uh, we thought we'd answer one of the questions that's been bugging us, and that is, how slow is a 12 volt kettle to actually boil? So we've set up a little demonstration or test. Uh, we've got a traditional on the hob whistle kettle. We've got a normal 2.2 kilowatt kettle. And then over there, Christian pans around. We have a 12 volt kettle uh, with a dog underneath it for some reason. So what we've done is we've put the same amount of water in each of the three kettles. We were going to put two cups of motorhome tea. We know the motorhome tea because it says so on the cup. Uh, but unfortunately that wasn't enough water for the standard 230 volt kettle. So we decided to make it three mugs. But unfortunately three mugs was too much for the 12 volt kettle. So we've gone for 0.75 litres in each of the kettles uh, to keep it fairly accurate. So the flame is lit, uh, so what we're going to do now is turn them all on at roughly the same point um, with the stopwatch running and see which one boils first. I don't think there's going to be any surprises on the first one. Shout out the time when it clicks, Kimberly. <coughs> Three, what's the time? Seven minutes and six seconds for the guest kettle. I'm not sure that's actually getting warm. Let's see where we are. Oh yeah, 27 degrees. We might be here a while. <laughs> So we thought we'd have a latte while we waited for the kettle to boil, which could be a while. We might be having lunch as well. Well, we've been going now for 16 minutes and we've managed to reach uh, 33 degrees. So I think what everyone's been telling us about 12 volt kettles being rubbish is actually true. What do you think, Kimberly? I think it most definitely is true. Dog's fed up waiting. He's fast asleep. George. Fed up waiting, mate. So we're coming up to half an hour now. And we are at 53 degrees. So given it's taken 30 minutes to get to 53 degrees, life's too short, we're going to call a halt to the test here. So no real surprises there. The only surprise for me was how long the uh, the 12 volt kettle took to, yeah. boil, or to boil. I say to boil, it didn't even get anywhere near boiling. So I think everything we've heard about them, um, 12 volt kettles, is probably true. The only other permutation that we weren't able to do was one of the low power kettles, mains kettles, we've got one on order but it hasn't turned up yet but we will do the same test with that to see um, how long that takes to boil um, because it uses less energy which is important because we were away um, in January on a site with six amps and with everything turned off if we put the kettle on it tripped the post outside so we had to revert back to the gas kettle um, but yeah we'll give that a go and see which one's best <laughs> 